Chapman, what would you do if your child went missing? After freaking out? Yes. <laughs> well, tonight our tech guys are here to show us a new free and easy program that could make a big difference during an Amber Alert. Okay, guys. Herb Tabin, Craig Agronoff joining us. So uh, this app is called Child ID, and it's a first from the FBI, right? Yeah, that's right, Eric. For the first time ever, the FBI has launched a new mobile application to help put the safety of children in the hands of their parents or guardians. Now imagine this. You're at the mall with your children when one of them, God forbid, disappears. You look around, you can't find them anywhere. What do you do next? Well, if you have downloaded Child ID from the FBI on your iPhone, you would be ready to instantly notify authorities. It's free, and it could become a lifesaver during an Amber Alert when those first seconds count. All right, so how can I get this app? Well, as Craig said, the app is free and can be downloaded through iTunes. Just uh, look up FBI Child ID and you'll find it. Uh, right now, it's available for the iPhone, iPod, and iPad, and in the future, they're looking for an Android app as well. All right, so I download the app. What's next? Well, after downloading the app, you just want to add your child's picture, their physical description, and their fingerprints if you want. According to the FBI, the intent of this app is to um, have the user have the information, of the, uh, information immediately available in the event of an emergency. So I guess that uh, if you have the app and my child goes missing, what should you do? Okay, in this horrific event, you would press a button that calls 911 or notify the National Center for Missing and Exploited Children, and the police are immediately notified. Now, at least they have a picture and description of your child, which is crucial in those first few minutes of an Amber Alert. So now that the app is from the, I, um, from the FBI, I assume that it's safe, or is it? Kind of. <laughs> well, while the app is receiving positive reviews, the only problem I see is it should have been password protected. Now, Herb, I mean, in other words, if you lost your phone right. in the mall and a stranger picked it up, they could potentially open the Child ID app and view your children's information. That kind of spooks me out a little bit, but I'm yeah. sure that later versions of this will address that concern. Well, you should already have your iPhone, I, your, your phone password protected, correct? And yeah, that would kind of get around that. If they managed to break into it, they'd be able to see all that information on your children, and there's nothing more precious than our children. Right. So, All, all right. right. Craig Agronoff, Herb Tabin, good information once and, again. And to get information on the FBI Child IG, just go to cbs12.com links. Thanks, guys. Good information as always.